what you see in front of you. You aren't determined like a clock in what you're going to do that day. In fact, your consciousness is in fact that part of you that deals with what is not yet determined. Because all the things that you do that are fundamentally habitual and deterministic right. are unconscious. Right. They turn into habit and you don't have conscious control over them. So consciousness seems to be that element that deals with what has not yet been determined. Okay, so you wake up in the morning and what you confront as far as I'm concerned is potential. There's a, there's a field of potential in front of you and that, that's the future, what it, whatever that is, that potential. It's, it's what could be and what is not yet. And then as a consequence of the choices that you make, guided by your ethical aims, then you transform that potential into actuality. And you literally do that with your consciousness. And I think that's the reflection of the image of God in man. And I think that's what's put forward in the earliest sections of Genesis, because that's what God does, right?